that the GTA Definitive Edition it would seem Rockstar has lost a bit of its luster. Or would, if you were to play it right now on PC. Coming down from Video Games Chronicle, written by Andy Robinson. Grand Theft Auto, the Trilogy Definitive Edition, Chaotic Launch, continued on Saturday as Rockstar confirmed it's pulled the PC version to remove unintentionally included game files. That potentially included unlicensed music, full game script with developer notes, and even files claimed by users to be related to the infamous can San Andreas sex minigame, A Coffee. After the start of writing, GTA Trilogy has been unavailable on PC for nearly two days. Rockstar PC launcher finally went back online after 24 hour downtime on Saturday, but the video edition remained locked out. Not to mention, when the launcher was locked out initially, it also locked out every other game in the service that no one could play on PC, including the very successful GTA 5 Online. But reviews coming in the past week stated that the game was riddled with bugs. On top of some of the game comparisons shots between the old and new games, it seems Rockstar Games didn't give these games the love and care that you should do, like in their previous titles. So I'll even calling it the next Cyberpunk 2077. Ouch! We're to find out what happens next for these titles in the next coming weeks. In the meantime, join me next week for another edition of Off the Cuff.